What up, gang? Matt here, Country Song Teacher. Hope you're doing well. Just heard this song on the way back from lunch. I should probably go to bed. Dan and Shay. I said, man, it's a jam. I gotta teach that one. It's got some fun little chords. It's got an E7 chord. It's gonna sound really cool. Uh, throw that in there. So for the verses and most of the chorus, we see E7, A minor, F. You know, I always title my lessons beginner guitar lesson. This is kind of not beginner, but hey, we'll keep with the theme, right? So again, capo the first fret, put the same key that they play in. Uh, Dan and Shay's, I can probably. Uh, he sings all. What is it, Shay? Uh, yeah, Shay's the one. Uh, I think it's right. Is Shay right? Let me know in the, in the comment section below. Shay's right, boy. Uh, Shay's the one that goes all high and stuff, so I can be doing that. Um, so start the regular C chord. You know, usually I play a C at nine, but do the second. Of the first fret relative to the capo, second string, fourth string, fifth string. Of the first, second, third fret. It's from bottom five. So you're going to do two down strums. All of my friends. Now, E7 is really an easy chord to play. Play the third string of the first fret and the fifth string of the second fret. So just two strings. Third string and fifth string. Well, six. Then A minor is the second string of the first fret in the fourth and third. Just on the bottom five. And then an F chord, I go from that A minor, keep your first finger on the, on the second string, play the fifth and fourth string of the third fret, and I take my middle finger on and off that third string. And I start out with it on there. So again, if you want to play the bottom two, that's fine. A lot of times I'll just press that one string. Second, third, fifth, fourth. Again, I'll take that middle finger on and off there. So, C, E7, A minor, F. C, E7, A minor, F. All of my friends finally convinced me to get out of the past, to help me forget. So even though the kind of tempo changes, same chords in the same order there. In a crowd of strangers and lovers Someone told me that you were coming and Do one, one F I should probably go to bed I should probably turn it off my phone I should quit while I'm ahead I should probably leave you So you can see there for the verses and chorus, you kind of got that same tempo, kind of same progression of C, E7, A minor, F. We're gonna have the same thing over and over. Um, and then, I should probably go to bed. So that the end is gonna be a little bit tricky. So, So I did a, a, a C chord, then to a B, which is a little tricky, bar, bar that entire first fret, and then play these three strings, or a lot of times I'll just do the two middle ones. So, 
I bar the first fret, the two middle strings, the third fret. So two Bs or B flat, then an F, and then the last one is an F, F minor. So what you're gonna do is bar the first fret, and instead of the two middle strings, you're gonna play up the fifth and fourth string. I should probably go to bed. So again, it goes. So I always start with those down strums because you kind of chop away and I still this day, as long as I've been playing when I'm learning a song, I'm just doing those down strums. Kind of get that rhythm down. All of my friends finally convinced me to get out of the past to help me forget, help me move on Then I heard you back in town in a crowd Strangers and lovers I want to switch it up, you'll see me a lot of times doing videos. I do that a lot of times. What I'm doing is just one down strum and then kind of stopping just to keep that steady rhythm and timing. something. I, yesterday I did J, uh, Jake Owens Made For You and I said tomorrow, which would be today, that I'm going to do um, Seven Summers, Morgan Wallen. Wait a minute, Matt. You're already lying to your subscribers. Who does that? Who does that? Um, I know that has some tricky ones in it. Uh, it's going to use a... Seven Summer is going to be a little tricky. Y'all pumped for, I'm pumped by the way. I know we're talking about a Dan and Shay song. I'm pumped for Morgan Wallen. Morgan Wallen is probably my favorite artist right now, if I'm being totally honest. Um, I've seen him in concert. I've seen Dan and Shay. They were awesome too, by the way. Um, the place went crazy. It was an indoor arena, man. All acoustic stuff were real good. They, whenever they do just like acoustic guitar and sing, that's my favorite. Any kind of concert, just acoustic. I will sell my best. Till the river runs dry Like a bird upon the wind These waters on my sky I'll never reach my destination If I never try So I will sail my vessel Till the river runs dry Why did he, he, did he just play Garth Brooks? While talking about Morgan Wallen on a Dan and Shay tutorial video, yes he did. Yes he did. I don't know why I do it. Blame it all on my roots.
thunder rolls. I don't know what I'm doing. I gotta get, I gotta get back to work. All right, guys, check out my website. I always say countrysongteacher.com, countrysongteacher.com. If you want to support the channel, I've got a four-chord songbook that's 40 songs that use none of these tricky things I just taught. More like the G, C, E minor, D. Those four songs, I mean, those four chords. I got two guitar DVDs, one piano DVD. I'm wanting a lot of you all during this homeschool time where you're stuck at home to learn the piano, man. Piano is so fun. And even though I don't show it, I play a lot of piano at the house and all that kind of stuff. So go learn piano. Love you guys. Most importantly, God loves you. Holla.